Hi, today we're talking about Sutra 812 or 83 in Siddhanta Kalmadi. Uh, this is the second Sutra of the eighth book, which uh, is uh, telling us that we also skipped over the entire seventh book. And uh, we are now just a sutra away from the uh, Tripadi or Asitadva portion of the grammar, which will uh, include all of the next almost 100 uh, Sunday sutras that we are going to discuss. So for 812.83 in Siddhanta Comedy, Tasya Paramam Reeditam. Tasya param amreditam. Tasya param amreditam. Sanya Sutra, giving the name amredita. Amredita. Its later form is called amredita. Well, what's later form is called amredita? Well, that's what we would have learned if we had discussed 811, which was not in my original. Uh, uh, notes and so on, but it's not hard to find. 811 is <clears throat> Sarvasya Dve, Sarvasya Dve, two common place of one, one whole form, Sarvasya, Sarvasya Stane, Dve, in place of one whole thing, two comes. Well, that's a little vague, but that's how Adhikara Sutras are. They provide a general concept for the rest of this chapter, and the specifics get filled in in, the, in the, each rule one by one. Uh, so uh, we would have known this uh, as was an Adhikara Sutra because in the good old days it would have been uh, spoken with a Swarita by Swarite Nati Karaha, but <clears throat> it's not hard to sort out without that now. In any case, Amredita comes into play because we have discussed the sutra some time ago, 6199, Namredita Syantya Syatuva, Namredita Syantya that was video number 101 in our sequence. <clears throat> that, that sutra obviously doesn't make a lot of sense if we don't know what an amredita is. Namredita syantya syatuva. Uh, but now we do, and we have that uh, sanya that we need. That, that sutra, namredita syantya syatuva, had to do with a sequence of Pararupa Adesha that uh, is refined to a particular point with this sutra, which says that the uh, final ut of a repeated uh, imitation sound is not replaced by the following Pararupa However, the t of the final ut of the uh, imitation sound can be optionally replaced. In that way, if we take the uh, vi virukta of patat, which would be patat patat, which we get by sarvasya dve, and we follow it by iti, that's the condition for this sutra, for Namaridita Syatya Syatuva, we have two possibilities. The one possibility we don't have is Partiti, Partiti, because that would be the E, the following the Pararupa E, replacing all of the Ut of par, the second Patat. So we don't get Partiti, Patat Partiti. But we do get two options. First is patat pataditi, patat pataditi, which is just patat and patat and et, uh, just uh, 
joining the second patat and with the one uh, modification from a sutra we're about to discuss shortly chalam jashonte chalam jashonte 8239 or 84 in Siddhanta Kalmadi, which changes the t of patat to d. So we have patat patat plus it, patat pataditi, patat patat pataditi. And then with uh, this sutra, 6199 of uh, Namredita Syantya Syatuva, we have the option of having the E of ET being a pararupa replacement, not of the whole at, but of the T of at. So we get patat pateti with guna, patat pateti. And that's the context for our word of the day, amredita.